Hi editors, here's how to create this thermal blur effect in After Effects. Create a new composition and call it Text Comp. You have to switch bit depth to 16 bits per channel. Create a new text layer and center it. Create a new shape layer. Use Ellipse tool to create a circle, center it, and make its color black. Call this layer Blur Map and add Fastbox Blur effect to it. Switch the blur radius to 1 and 25 and uncheck the repeat edge pixels. Next, add a solid composite effect to it. Place the layer below the text and disable it. Create a new adjustment layer and call it Blur Displacement. Add a camera lens blur effect to it and set the setting as we do in the example. Next, create a new adjustment layer and call it color grain. Add a solid composite effect to it and switch the effect's color to black. Next, add a colorama effect to it. Change the colors to the same as we do. You can find the hex of colors in the description for convenience. Hold shift and drag black color to the middle, then the white color to the middle. Make sure you drag the black first. Next, add noise alpha effect and place it over all other effects. Set the same settings as we do. Create a new solid and call it Fractal Noise. Add a Fractal Noise effect to it. Set the same values as we do. Hold Alt and click on the evolution parameter to create the expression. Write a time 100 expression. Now add a Fastbox Blur effect and set the blur radius to 50.
add a calculations effect with the same settings as in the video. Disable the fractal blur layer and drag it below. If you're into animation, check our 4000 templates for video editing. Here you can find dozens of video templates for your project, from title animation to YouTube outros and much more. Pick a template for the software you use and preview all categories included inside. Video editing has never been easier. So make sure you have visited our easyedit.pro website. Now add a displacement map effect to our blur displacement layer and set it like we do in the video. Duplicate the effect and change the values to minus 100 to align the composition. Create a new adjustment layer and call it Glow. Add a Glow effect to it. Set the glow radius to 43, change glow intensity to 0.4. Duplicate it and set the same values as in the example. Create a new adjustment layer and call it Curves. Add a curves effect and set the curve as in the example. By changing the scale, position, and rotation, we can control the effect and influence the text. Hold Alt and click on the scale. Write down the wiggle effect with the same values as we do here. Repeat the same for the position parameter. Here, we can see how the changes are applied on the blur map. Disable the blur map layer and create a new null object. Parent it to our blur map. And create a little in animation for the scale. Go to the 50th frame and add a keyframe with 100% value. Go to 0 frame and add the keyframe with 0% value. Select all keyframes, press Fn plus F9 and easy ease them. Set the speed graphs. Go to the Curves layer and add a noise effect to it. Set 
Set the noise to around 10% and uncheck Use Color Noise. Our blur displacement effect is ready. If you like the result, make sure to hit the like button and follow our channel for more tutorials. See you in next video.